Thank you, Governor and Lieutenant Governor, for coming here. It really means a lot to all of us on this site. My name is Meg Roosh, and I'm the research and development site leader here. As John mentioned, here at Pfizer Andover, we are very proud to play a key role in the fight against COVID-19. We have recently begun manufacturing a key component called the drug substance for the COVID-19 investigational vaccine candidate. This manufacturing is being undertaken at risk so that we are ready with this drug substance if clinical trials are successful and regulatory authorization is granted by the FDA. I'd like to share a little bit more about the exciting work we do here and about the COVID-19 vaccine candidate. In March, Pfizer and BioNTech announced a collaboration to develop a potential COVID-19 vaccine. This collaboration brought together BioNTech's proprietary mRNA vaccine platform and Pfizer's extensive experience in the global development and manufacturing of vaccines. This mRNA vaccine introduces into the body the genetic instructions for the cell to make a specific protein, in this case, a SARS-CoV-2 protein, which is intended to stimulate an immune response. We make that mRNA right here in Andover using a well-controlled process involving a template mRNA building blocks and enzymes. The mRNA component of the vaccine candidate is purified and shipped as a frozen solution to other Pfizer global facilities for further manufacture and filling into vials. To prepare for this manufacturing over the past months, our scientists have been studying the production process, determining how to make larger batches called scaling up, and implementing testing protocols to closely and carefully study the vaccine candidate's quality. Clinical data for the vaccine has been encouraging so far. Earlier this month, we announced positive preliminary top-line phase one, two findings. And just this week, we announced the start of a large phase two, three safety and efficacy trial with our lead COVID-19 investigational vaccine candidate. We have the potential subject to technical success and regulatory authorization to manufacture up to 100 million vaccine doses by the end of this year and up to 1.3 doses by the end 1.3 billion doses by the end of 2021 our ability to manufacture mrna with quality and speed at pfizer andover is due to the outstanding scientists engineers and support staff we have here in the fight against this global pandemic we truly believe that science will win. I'm very proud to be working here at Pfizer in Massachusetts. We are truly contributing to, vac to breakthroughs that change patients' lives.